Yeah, for, for years, the building officials always seem to be on the back burner on, um, on the beginning of projects. And they've um, pretty much only taken a role when the plans are submitted for construction. Um, what I feel is, is that we need to be involved from the very beginning to help evolve these projects into a very green product. And with the process that we have in place and one that I hope everybody will embrace will be that everybody that's, that's necessary to a project will be involved at an early stage. Overall, I would say that, that the way things used to be um, are not sustainable. Building officials have to look within themselves to find other ways to help do their jobs. And with the way the economy is, you're not going to be hiring the same staff that maybe you once had. Uh, for quite some time. So you have to look at different ways and different ways to do that are through green initiatives, sustainability, technology and other initiatives that are out there. And if you do that then you're going to be able to be in the forefront and not sitting in the back and it's really the way to go. It's a common document. It's something that will bring us, help bring us together even closer. Uh, it always seemed for, for many years that uh, building officials and, and uh, the people up in a jurisdiction were on one side of the counter and the design professionals and contractors were on the other. And what we've done at the City of Bend is we've brought both sides together and have, de have determined that we're in this together. And if we're not in this together, it's not going to work. So the IGCC is another document that's going to help bring us closer for green construction. Yeah, we, we have uh, meetings quite often. I, would say, I don't know if it's monthly or how often they occur, but they occur as necessary. Um, the last thing I ever wanted to do was have a meeting, just have a meeting. So we pretty much have to have an agenda item. But what we are planning on doing with the new green code is to have meetings with um, our contractors and design professionals and everybody that's involved, whether it's elected officials, other staff members, in order to get everything out on the front burner and identify where we need to go with this in the city of Bend to make it a success. We have uh, compared a LEED Gold certified building against the IGCC and found that the two are very compatible. Uh, we have presented that to the city of Richland uh, to help them in selecting the jurisdictional requirements and we plan on having additional discussions with them and helping them decide what jurisdictional requirements make sense for their. It being a new code and being something brand new, it took between eight and ten hours really to carefully review the code and have a, a basic understanding of, of the code provisions. Uh, I then sought additional information through webinars and online research to see what tools were out there, what was available, and really didn't find anything which is to be expected with such a, a new code. I developed a checklist uh, that took me about two or three hours to go through and develop a checklist and, and make sure that each of the code provisions were outlined. And then I would say uh, it took probably two hours to review the building against that checklist. So it's an exciting thing for me. Uh, I really feel like th the public is saying to architects that we need to do better by the community. We need to raise the standard and really incorporate sustainability into buildings. Obviously there's the energy efficiency and efficiency of materials that will be inherent. Uh, I think it'll result in, in better built buildings for our clients and for building occupants, uh, lower cost of operation, and just overall less impact to the environment. The IGCC is a minimum code, but they need to go beyond just enforcing the code. They need to work proactively with the uh, government officials, with the lawmakers, and with the community to make sure that uh, all aspects of sustainable design are implemented throughout the, the community.